hi friends welcome to civil engineering world so in this video i'm gonna tell you how you can calculate the minimum steel for beams and slab so before going ahead please uh, make sure to subscribe our channel because we make uh, videos every single day related to design of concrete and all other subjects related to civil engineering so if you are somebody who are watching my video for the very first time then I appreciate you and please go ahead and subscribe the channel for more videos okay so let's get started so in this particular video actually we are going to learn about uh, the minimum steel that is required for both beams beams and slabs although there are a lot of other requirements that are needed uh, for design of steel such as uh, the type of loadings uh, the type of end conditions and most importantly the grades of concrete so but in this formula we are gonna uh, see how we can calculate the minimum steel for slab and beams okay so let's get into this so we are having a very simple formula and before uh, going in into that I'm just gonna tell you the different grades of concrete so in this um, row I have just mentioned some of the grades of concrete uh, in uh, uh, in megapascal so the here is 25 uh, 25 megapascal 25 or uh, you can say a 28 grade grade of concrete here it comes 30 grade of concrete uh, and next is 35 and 40 grades of concrete so these are different grades of concrete so depending upon the grades of concrete actually it really affects the um, steel ratio so we have to adjust our steel ratio with the grades of concrete because changing the grades of concrete uh, really affect the steel requirement okay so here we have a minimum formula that we can actually use uh, to simply calculate the minimum amount or minimum percentage of steel that is required uh, for both beams and slabs as I have already mentioned that there might be other factors that really contribute towards the requirement of steel but this is a thumb, thumb rule and that can be applied to both beams and slabs okay so here the minimum formula of steel is written as 0.016 fck raised to power 2 or 3 so fck is actually 28 days compressive strength of concrete so for example if you are just changing the grades of concrete and you can just simply uh, put the a value of 28 28 days compressive strength of that group specific grade of concrete and after that you can multiply it to get the minimum percentage of steel so similarly i have calculated the minimum percentage of steel for different grades of concrete so as you can see in in the first line i have mentioned the concrete grades that uh, ranges from 25 to 40 and in second one I have calculated the minimum percentage of steel by using this formula. So uh, for 25 grade of concrete, uh, the, the required minimum percentage of steel is 0.14%. Uh, all right. So similarly, we can also calculate for 28 grade of concrete that comes as 0.15 percent and similarly for 30 grade of concrete it comes as 0 0.15 uh, because there is no much difference so it comes as 0 0.15 percent and for similarly for 35 and 40 grade of concrete is 0 0.17 and 0 0.2 respectively so these are the minimum steel percentages that you can use whenever you are going to design beam or uh, slab so these are basically minimum requirements of steel that you have to consider while design any any kind of structure so friends this was a very short video in which i have covered the minimum steel re reinforcement that is required for both beams and also for slab so if you have liked this video then please go ahead and subscribe our channel uh, for more videos thank you so much for watching and i'll see you later